Emergency medicine is an in incredible medical specialty. I think one of the things that certainly drew me to emergency medicine and draws a lot of folks to our specialty is the fact that you get to work with adults and children. You get to practice medicine, but also some minor procedures as well. Um, so it really draws in so many different elements from the entire house of medicine. Uh, one of the really fascinating things about emergency medicine is that you sort of sit at the center of a wheel in the entire house of medicine. So you interact with all medical specialties on a, on a routine basis. Now the thing about an emergency department is interesting. If you think about it, uh, an emergency department is actually a speed up of a normal hospitalization. The organizing theme of emergency medicine is time. The emergency department takes care of the first 60 minutes of any presentation of any illness that a patient has. As physicians, our role is to certainly be clinicians, uh, also to be researchers uh, and to kind of continue that scientific inquiry. Research in this environment, on one hand, uh, is crazy. You never know what's going to come through. I don't think that any of us would ever say that in three or four years you're going to see everything, but you get pretty close to it here. You capture a very small snapshot of someone's life. Uh, you see them at the worst time of their lives oftentimes. Research really has expanded my uh, perspective on what happens after they leave the emergency department because we can follow them and we know that this impact of trauma or an injury that they sustain isn't better that at the time that they leave. We view research as a regular part of patient care. We want to have the opportunity to try to answer the dozens and dozens of questions that come up every day. It's a physician's job to understand what is and what is not innovative and to document what should become care, what, what we should go back and take to patients as a standard. And I think that that's where researchers help decide what is kind of the next step and what is important for the community that they're working in. As physicians, we'll get fed data every day and you want to be able to interpret those data um, in a reliable way. And if you work on your own project or on a project, you start to understand some of the limitations of research. One project uh, that we're working on is women's health study. Uh, we are looking at the impact of violence on a, a woman's health, um, but over the course of the time and how that changes and how that really impacts someone's life. We know that um, trauma and violence specifically impacts someone's life to a great degree. And we're looking at why this develops and hopefully looking at ways to change that outcome. It's very important for our residents to understand the scholarly process. Because at the end of the day, when we're attending physicians and we're practicing and we're taking care of patients, we're ultimately utilizers of medical research. I think when I finally came to understand how we generate useful knowledge for people, I, I realized that everything we do in medicine had to come from somewhere. Uh, and I, I think that it's really amazing that we're able to take a question, answer it using statistical techniques, and then make use of it to help people. It's uh, very satisfying and really, to me, the three important parts of being a physician, being working clinically, uh, contributing back to the knowledge base that you've benefited from, uh, both as an educator and as a researcher. I love being a resident here. I would, would choose it every single time. Uh, and what I always say to people, you know, if it works at MedStar, it will work anywhere because we are every healthcare system. A quote from a pioneering computer scientist, uh, Alan Kay, the best way to predict the future is to invent it. And so um, that's what we do here. Uh, that's what we've done in the emergency department. That's what we do in the MedStar Institute for Innovation. And that's what you can do if you come join us uh, on this wonderful journey.